I'm here today with John Tomazos. He is the chairman for Texas Rare Earths. John, how are you today? Just fine. John, I'm so delighted to have you here. You have such an established career in the equities market, and I know you know what you're talking about. So what I want you to do is help our audience understand why we are such enthusiasts behind Texas Rare Earth. So let's talk about your economics first and foremost. Well, we were attracted because we have a billion ton mountain outcropping with near zero strip, four miles from Interstate 10, with a paved road right up to the mountain, a rail spurt for a 7,000 ton a day aggregate quarry. And we're analyzing our mine like it were a copper heap leach mine with a 0.8% at low rare earth price copper grade. One thing that has always impressed me about Texas Rare Earths is a no-nonsense uh, management style. So let's get right down to your most recent achievements. What do you feel like our audience needs to understand that yours is your biggest accomplishment recently? Well, we have a, a billion pounds of heavy rare earth oxides uh, skewed toward dysprosium, yttrium, terbium, holmium, erbium, lutetidium, and thulium. Secondly, we have the richest beryllium deposit in the world with a thousand ton production size tunnel right into it. Third, we have uh, a uranium resource that would rank us number 14 in the world as a country in World Nuclear Association tables. Our thorium would rank us number nine in the world as a country. Okay, so what would the timeline be towards uh, this economic production? We need to go to definitive feasibility study, finance, permit. A heap bleach mine might get built in uh, 15 months. Okay, so what kind of benchmarks should we be looking forward to this year, John? We had a program last year for a $2.13 billion, 80,000 ton a day froth flotation process. But we don't have $2 billion. So I said inspirationally uh, when we changed the board last August, let's try to do a heap bleach that we could build very cheaply. Yeah, you know, capital is dear. So we have a laboratory that's done a sulfuric acid heat bleach, just like a copper heat bleach. And we need to engineer that process to find the acid consumption and have a book with rates of returns. Let me ask you another question. You have the advantage, of course, of being located in the United States where there is uh, a real acknowledgement of wanting to have a sustainable uh, infrastructure and vertical integration for production. Can you tell me if you're speaking to anyone uh, or you're receiving any benefits uh, that are helping provide you with more advantages that your shareholders or interested parties should know about? The state of Texas is doing great work right now to improve our land package, to greatly enlarge our land package, not for mineral exploration, but to have a big buffer around our property and we have nice quiet for 20,000 tons a day or whatever we're going to process. And as time goes on and some of these land improvements occur, we'll be able to tell the public more about how helpful, helpful the state of Texas is. Well, you've heard it here first. We have infrastructure, we have size and fortitude, and of course they're backed by the state of Texas. John, thank you so much.